All right, this is the sister truck to that uh, beautiful baby blue one right there. This is the one we actually wanted. It's a 2019. It's got the DD15 DT12 automatic. Four, oh uh, shit. Um, <laughs> four or something of the miles. We'll look when we get inside it. This thing is spotless. Very nice. Let's go ahead and do the door test. As we walk up, obviously there's no damage to the, to the fairings. The cab extender, the side of the cab, the mirrors, everything is pristine. Let's go ahead and do the door test. Beautiful. A little bit of dirt and stuff for me getting in and out. There's your fire extinguisher. This does have a Thermo King APU. There's your power inverter. Nice. Got the wheel covers, sliding fifth wheel. There's some lights going. All your rubbers in good shape. Your drums, I inspected it when it came in. Your drums are in good condition, no uh, no lip right there. No damage to the back of the cab. As we move along to this side, you'll see the uh, Thermo King APU. That is my preferred APU. Moving along, no damage to the fairings, the cab extender, or the side of the cab, or the mirrors. This thing is just pristine. Door test it. Beautiful. Let's hope. Now I did notice this is a little hard to close. I'm going to slap some fifth wheel grease on it, see if it doesn't loosen things up. There's your reflectors. It's weird this on this side, and it's bolted in. It's not just put there. Typically, I see reflectors on the uh, driver's side, but I guess maybe they figure you're pulling over to the right. A little bit of like lint there. I guess you're they're figuring you pull over to the right, so you're not on the side of the road. Let's see if this closes first time. See, no, it doesn't. And that's why we check. I'm going to go ahead and loop that up. That should take care of that. Aluminum wheels all the way around. No damage to the bumper, the hood, the grill. Oh, fuck, I lied. A little bit of a scuff, it looks like, right here. Oh, no, that's just some, something or another. So let's have the Bindex system. Ah, and it's going to want to fight me, so... Cupping on the tires. These look new. Look at that. Go ahead and check low bar. No damage to the bumper or the hood. Now I should probably mention this truck does come, like most of our trucks, with a six month, 50,000 mile nationwide warranty. You can extend that two years or 200,000 miles. It covers the engine, transmission, turbo, rears, and the full after treatment. As we move along here, no damage to the bumper or the hood. Or a windshield on this one. <laughs> I know a lot of them have oil build up right there. 
Now this is squeaking a little bit. It's probably just that tensioner right there. Uh, I'll probably replace it at some point. But uh, yeah, a lot of these have oil going up right there. Not on this one. You love to see it. This truck does have 455 horsepower. You can go ahead and pop in this side. Look at these door panels. Super clean. I wish it didn't do this though. So this truck has no active faults, but the active is for the fuel. I wish it didn't do that. I, I know that there's, I know that we need fuel. Shut up. <laughs> Let's see, this is 483, 445. Go ahead and shut this off. So that's the radio. There's some beautiful static. Let's try the wash. Beautiful. And let's just try the wipers. Very nice. City horn? Air horn. Alright. Everything opens and closes in this, as you'd expect. Very clean in there, like all of our stuff. This is obviously a double bunk, if you didn't see it when I got in. There's all the uh, window shades. They go missing, so I take them off. Plus, it kind of shows better, in my opinion. You get more light, you can see things vivid. More vividly, anyways. Um... Yeah. Sleeping area is nice and clean. You do have footprints from me getting up and taking my pictures. Uh, but other than that, very nice. Alright. I'm going to park it right there next to the T680s. It's beeping, of course, because I don't have my seatbelt on. move this to the freight liners here shortly but for now it can sit comfortably between two t680s no i'm sorry that's peterbilt i work here and i don't know what i have there's your uh dt12 automatic shifter uh yeah you got your you got your suspension dump there we go you have your sliding disc wheel and the disc lock all right, now uh, I think that is everything. If you were, uh, that is that is interesting. So this button doesn't go down. You tap it in, I guess once it. That's weird. So these are toggles. That is not. You hit it once, and then you hit it once again to go off. That's weird. AC is nice and cold. Let's get that fan blowing. Very nice. If you're interested, come see us. Uh, thanks for watching.